and gentlemen, welcome back to more The Evil Within. When we last left off, we'd made it to chapter 10, I believe. Uh, what sort of equipment do we have in store? Ah, uh, okay. Not bad, actually. Not terrible, not terrible. Ooh, we've got two medkits. All right, not bad. Right, let's get this party going, shall we? We've just had our little adventure through Ruben's uh, mansion. We fought the Blood Beast and a few other things. I can't really remember. It's been a little while. But we've been doing all kinds of weird stuff in this mad dream machine. How many have you killed, Ruben? Ruben? Does he mean Ruvik? Numbers are irrelevant. They received as they themselves gave. And they served a higher purpose. They furthered my research. This was not mere research. The things the papers say were done to those people, those traps. These vermin? These microbes? They're mine to do with as I please. Mm. But you are correct. This was not mere research. I'm close to perfection. This is abhorrent. This is my will. Yeah, um, okay. Not exactly being the nicest fellow on the block, but, you know, that's fine. Be a pretty boring game otherwise, wouldn't it? Okay, so we've got a few goodies. Uh, we could go... Oh, yeah, there's a document over here. Manson... Manson? Mansion basement note. My children have been taken from me. Was it fate? Was it something he did? Surely not. My perfect son. It was that fire. It ruined everything. It took everything. The children are not the same. And neither is uh, Ernest. Ernesto? He said he was taking care of them. Uh, that they would be safe. But now he says they're gone. How could that be? A mother would know such a thing. I still hear my darling boy's voice. His laughter. And always from the basement. It cannot be. A mother needs her children. Yeah, kind of like <laughs> stupid really. Just, you know, why didn't she just go into the basement? Oh right, because her husband forbid it. Yeah, I'd... Alright, sure. Sure. Anywho, back to the mirror world we go. Is there any goodies in here? Don't think so, but whatever. Let's go and see our darling nurse. See what she's doing. Oh, my head. They've got some noisy neighbours. Bastards. There's always somebody making a load of noise in the cell next to you. Who is that guy next door? I don't know, Sebastian, but he is doing his best to make as much noise as humanly possible. Alright, so. Alright, nurse, how's it going? Yeah, there, buddy. Do you have any idea why this world is the way it is? Yes. What? Who are you? Hate. Hate. Rubik's hate. The man's consumed by it. He wants out. Wants to get his revenge. He wants back what he feels the world took from him. It's not like he could actually get that. <laughs> it's not like he could actually get that. This world exists as long as he does. You heard something just now? We did, nurse. Yes, we did. So, um, yeah, I mean, Rubik, well... We'll see. Ruvik Ruben. I'm not. I can't remember actually why they changed his name. Like why he's called Ruvik and Ruben. I I forget. Uh, wealthy landowner and wife die in car crash. Nightmare for family. Bodies of Ernesto and Beatriz uh, Victoriano found in wreck. Son inherits the family's fortune. Yeah, yeah. Definitely didn't like you know slash his parents up. Because he was locked in a basement for ages. And his mother is like completely innocent really. I guess. We, we, they don't really tell us. 
Um, okay, so keys, keys. We have two keys. This is excellent. So behind door num number one, we have brain gel. Yay for brain gel. Behind door number two, we have brain gel. Oh, that was a waste of time. All right, let's go back to the front. Because this chapter, well, we meet a new enemy in this chapter, actually, which, you know, ordinarily isn't too much of a problem, but, hmm, I guess we'll, <laughs> I guess we'll see what we see. Oh, hang on, this, yes, this is the chapter with the whirly majig, the tilt -a whirl if you will. Ah, yes, yes, it's kind of coming back. All right, yeah, this one's going to be, this is going to be something. Okay. Oof, oh, bullets, we like bullets. We need those to shoot people with. There's lots of traps around here. Yes. See, if we walk into that, that door's going to snap shut. Can't remember, actually, what's in that door. Can we disarm it? Can we? There we go. Yeah, can't remember what's in here. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Not bad. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. We need as many parts for our bloody crossbow as we can possibly get. Alright, not bad. Yeah, if you walk into that um, tripwire, these snap shut. Rather nasty looking things. Look like they're right out of Vietnam. Uh, they don't actually hurt you at all, but you just can't get in that room. Okay, let's keep sneaking forwards. Oh, some brain gel. Somebody's at the dentist. Okay. Ah, definitely a dentist. All right, cool. Righty tighty, checkpoint. Yeah, the, uh, this bit. This bit was really, really cheap. Uh, from what I can remember. Right, there's a trap there. There's a bloody trap right there, which I couldn't even see. Only saw it because we had a, a prompt. There's a couple of things like that here. We can turn our torch on. So we've got a massive blade in the middle that spins around. And I remember if we stand up, actually, it's pretty good um, for killing enemies. But yeah, like if you even get anywhere near that thing, it takes your head off. And the hitbox is extremely unforgiving. Oh, shit. There we go. Tilt a whirl. Here it comes. Here it comes. Nope, 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 nope. I'm on fire. Need to duck. Duck, Sab. Yeah, ducking in this game is certainly something. So when you want to duck, you need to push the button about three or four seconds before you actually want to duck. Because it takes Sebastian that long to think about it and then to do the animation. Which is actually, like, kind of a problem here. Oh, God, do I remember this bit. I believe that thing had me head a few times. Yeah, instant death mechanics. We know how I feel about instant death mechanics. Um, they're shit. But that's fine. At least we've done this once or twice before. 
Oh! Yeah! Remember him too. Hello. Hello, love. It's going to get a little bit awkward. Okay. Definitely going to get a little bit awkward. Alright, Sebastian. Alright, we'll let her burn to death and then we're going to go take a heal. Alright. Have a bit of a breather there. Yeah, I think that was just the, the main issue with, with everything in this game. It's... Oh my god, like when you don't play it for a while, you genuinely forget, there he is, genuinely forget just how slow everything is, like the movement, come on, let's see that little brain of yours, oof, but then you remember just how nice this rifle is, oh, that's a nice rifle. Just him? Okay. I kind of get the feeling that there's a key on one of these. Uh, I don't know though. Maybe not. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. Right. Anyway. Let's keep moving. For now. Oh, we've got some deadites. We've got some deadites up here. Got some shotgun shells there, which is not, well, a singular shotgun shell, which I suppose is better than no shotgun shells. Hmm. 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 Okay. Couple of juicy looking backs here that we can sink a knife into. It's one of those guys with the porcelain armored faces. We don't oh he's got a gun as well. Kinda cute that is. Oh, hi. Hello. How are you doing? Can we even stealth kill these guys? We can. Alright. I couldn't actually remember then. If you could stealth kill the big guys, I guess you can. That's going to save us some uh, some bullets. All right, jackass, turn around. Come on. Time is money. With his little pirate gun that he's got there. Let's get rid of that pop gun for you. There we go. Alright, any more? Oh, right, yes, we need to collect that. Um, I forget exactly what that is. It's a key to some sort of door, I think. Right, let's grab this. Oof, that was close. I see you. You little sausage. Yes. Mine's bigger, mate. Well, we can't grab any of that, unfortunately. Alright, let's go grab the key. Oh, hello. That was a lucky shot. Didn't even see you there, sir. Didn't even see you there. Right, this is a large portable... Oh, right, battery pack. Very weird-looking battery pack. Portable cell that can be used to get electrical equipment working in an emergency. Well, okay. All right. We shall have this large portable cell. And we shall take it to wherever you take a large portable cell. And we can also check this out as well. Um, yay for more green news. Alright. 
Okay, so now down, down, deeper and down. So I guess the only real way... Oh, hang on, I think there's enemies out here now. Uh, mayhap. Come on. Yep, here we go. Here we go. Here we bloody go. Come on, up and over. Down. Ooh, he's gone. Oh, look at that one being a sneaky little sneaky bastard. Alright, well that's somewhat awkward. Unless... Is he going to try and... Oh, that's not good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, we're dead. We're dead. <sighs> God damn it. Now, where did the checkpoint put us? I suppose that's fine. Yeah, so... The first one's going to get his head chopped. The second one absolutely can get his head chopped. But... Hmm. I'll have those. So there's also a health thing in the middle there, which I didn't even realise was there. Ooh. Ooh, that was a... That was a better result than just loads of green gel. Alright. I'll take that. Maybe that death was worth it. Maybe. Oh! Evening. I didn't think you were there last time, were you? Correct me if I'm wrong. The world's most useless gun. Alright. Well, I mean, we'll take that. I suppose we're going to go all the bloody way back up to collect that bullet now as well. Because, you know, every little helps. God damn it. At least I think it was one bullet left up here. Yep, one bullet. But, you know, if you get into a very shitty situation, that one bullet might just save you. I mean, it probably won't. Let's be honest. In fact, it will definitely, probably, most likely not save you at all. But, you know. I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. Right, this is going to be the awkward bit. Well, he's gone. Now, this jackass here is going to be the problem. So let's meet him for glorious combat through here. Yeah, not going to get got, is he? Or is he? Son of a bitch. You're a fucking asshole, you know that? Come on, you little bastard. Yeah, have some of that. You think of that? Huh? That's right. Pro well, I say probably shouldn't have used that, but in all fairness, not going to get healed any other way, are we? See how long it takes to jump over something and then crouch back down again. It's almost not worth the hassle. Ah, that was sly. The avenue. Tread carefully. Oh. Hello. Can we not? Nope. I guess. I guess we can't just jump up and over there. You would have thought you could, but no. Can't just jump up and over. Don't ask me why. I didn't make the game. I see absolutely zero reason why we couldn't just jump up and over. 
But, you know. The evil within is going to evil within, I guess. Right, you're done. Who's next? Oh, hey, sweetheart. Let's get you done as well. Yeah, no idea why we can't just jump over that. You know, seems almost like that would be the obvious answer. Ah, oh, no. Well, we had to fail one at some point, I suppose. All right. What do we got? 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 We got a load of old shit. Alright. It's actually not that fantastic to take a hit like that. It's our last syringe. Oof. Okay. Right. Well, at least that gets us out of this bloody shithole. To be fair. Alright, we're good. We're good. We're good. Oh! I guess you just decided to get up, did you? I guess that makes sense. I'd probably want to get up if I had that much stuck through my body as well. Alright. It's only ammo. It's fine. It's not like we have a limit of it or anything. Now carefully does it. There we go. Oh god, at least with past that bloody blade. That thing is a little bit spicy. Hello. A lot of people not having a good time at the dentist today. A lot of people. I mean, generally the dentist isn't a good time anyway, but... Oh. We'll have you. Hmm. Ooh. What the? Yeah, that... We don't fight one here, though, do we? Yeah, that's the new enemy that we have to fight. They're actually reasonably burly. Um, well, uh, I mean, they are and they aren't, to be honest. They're not generally much of an issue, but because we have no ammo, uh, probably going to be a bit more of an issue than we would like them to be. Oh, I remember this. Yes. Grab you. Grab you. And get out. Yeah, I remember that bit. Oof. So. Got some more bullets. Yeah, we're definitely, like, at that point where the handgun is a waste of time. Almost. You know, if you've got, like, a complete full stock of handgun bullets, you can probably take out two enemies, like, two of the basic standard, um, taken, or whatever they're called. Right, so this big old switch here ain't gonna work, is it? No. Uh, no. Which is a kick in the knickers, so we're going to keep exploring this way. And this way is going to be full to the brim with deadites. Yeah. But that's okay. We can handle some deadites. Is that a grenade? It's a grenade, isn't it? Yep, yeah, but we, we can't pick it up. Because we are full of grenades. Full of everything, really. Um, so, we've got one. It's just one. 
coming this way. Hmm, that's not exactly great, is it? But, if... Are you going to turn? Yay! And the world rejoiced. Charging battery. Thanks for shouting that in my ears, headphone. I know you're charging battery. I plugged you in. Okay. Alright, if that dipshit can turn around. Right, let's take our chances. Oof, nice. We're going to be leaning quite heavily on this crossbow. Today, so... Or most likely in the next part, anyway. Don't... Do we want to still pipe? Oh. Yeah, I guess we might want to still pipe. Or a still pipe? I mean a bottle. Right, so we've got him. Trapes him backwards and forwards. Let's see if we can't sort him out. Beautiful. Oh. Another one this way. Well, we might be able to sort him out too. We're quick. Yep. That's the way it goes, Milado. Alright, cool. So, those two numb nuts taken out. Now, yeah. There's an enemy here that I think is very... Oh, there's a bomb there. Ah. Nope. I thought there was an enemy here that um, you couldn't sneak up on. Because no matter what you did, he... Always, like, had his... Oh, him! Yeah. I'm pretty sure, like, if you wake this guy up, no matter what you really do, he's always looking at you. Which makes sense in the fact that you've got to activate him. Okay, we're getting busy here, are we? Alright, calm down. Plenty for all of you. Good lord. That was going reasonably well. Did you say reasonably well? Okay, so we've got ourselves a battery pack. Makes sense. Ah, look. Oh, you little sly sausages. Look at that nonsense. Look at that absolute nonsense. One slip of the boot and it's good night. Good lord. Right, we'll have you. Keep your eyes out for the red glow. If you can't see red, you're dead. This, that rhyme, see? Red dead? Yeah, they should have called this game Red Dead. Because if you have red, you're dead. Alright, let's grab some more brain juice. Turn some lights on for a start. The light is weird in this game. Like sometimes, as I said, sometimes enemies will spot you when you've got the light on. Sometimes they won't. Uh, yeah, I I don't know. Like, what I'm trying to say is it's not Zelda, okay? I could be playing Zelda right now, right? But I'm not. I'm playing this. But then... Evening. But then I would be... I, I would enjoy playing Tears of the Kingdom, but... I need to 100% Breath of the Wild first. And at the time of recording this, I am 92.3% on Breath of the Wild. I have less than 100 fucking seeds to find. Hey Nintendo, next time, just put 2,000 in. Go for it. Why not? Yes, to get 100% in Zelda, you need to find all 900 Korok Seeds. 
And so far, I'm up to like 818 or something stupid. My concern is... I'm going to collect the last one on my map that I've printed out. And it ain't going to be the last one. But, whatever. Okay, checkpoint. Oh, we're actually on half an hour here. So... Because we're on half an hour, I might leave this one here because I've got to go to the pub. don't really want to go to the pub at the moment because I've got so much to do. But I have social engagements. Damn it. So I will catch you guys in the next episode.